Welcome to the Tick Mill Update. I'm Kiana Danielle, CEO of InvestDiva.com. On Thursday, the data showed that the number of people who applied for the U.S. jobless benefits at the end of September rose to a one-month high of 219,000, partly reflecting a three-week-old strike at General Motors that has idled tens of thousands of workers. Also, the September ISM non-manufacturing index showed that the U.S. economy is weaker than expected. Tomorrow, we have the all-important U.S. non-farm payrolls and the unemployment rate for September. Today, I'm looking at the dollar-yen pair, who's still trying to pierce through the daily Ichimoku cloud after failing to rise above the 108 resistance level. We have a couple of mixed messages here. First, the future Ichimoku cloud is bullish. Second, the pair is trying to confirm an angled double top bearish reversal chart pattern. With that, Friday's NFB could be the only hope to confirm the medium term direction for the dollar yen pair. Of course, trading the financial markets involves a risk of loss, and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our social media. I'll get back to you with more updates next week.